think I'll start the day off with a shot. A shot of fire water. That's right, fire water. You see, this water here is the exact same water right here, the Jordan River. At the Christ baptism, he enters into the Jordan River. And many Eastern Catholic churches today, we celebrate the baptism of Christ, which we call the Theophany of Christ, meaning the revelation of the Trinity, Theophanic, not just Epiphanic, Theophanic, the revelation of God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit at Christ baptism. As he immerses himself in that water and sanctifies that water, he becomes fire in that water. And last night at our services, the priest takes a three-branch candelabra and he plunges it into the water three times, saying prayers that call down the Holy Spirit. Then he breathes over that water, again calling down the Holy Spirit. Then he takes his hand in the form of a cross and makes the form of a cross in that water three times. And finally, he takes a, a hand cross, wooden hand cross, and plunges it into that water and crosses that water three times, all the time, calling down in magnificent prayers the action of the Holy Spirit so that this water becomes consecrated. It actually becomes the Jordan River, the same river that Christ entered into. It becomes that mystically. Now, this should not surprise you or sound like something silly. Every time we celebrate the Eucharistic liturgy or the Mass, bread and wine is consecrated. We call down the Holy Spirit upon it. It is consecrated. It is made into the actual body and blood of Christ. That same body and blood of Christ that existed 2,000 years ago walking around this earth. That same Eucharist that happened at that first Last Supper, that mystical supper. The bread and wine is changed by the words of the priest through the acts of the Holy Spirit. And so it is with this water. And this water is filled with the presence of the Holy Spirit. So we drink of it. We use it to bless. We keep in our churches and our homes on this feast of our Lord's baptism. The theophany it is epiphanic. Yes, it is epiphany. But in the Eastern churches, it is specifically theophanic. Not only epiphanic, theophanic. The revelation of the Trinity. God the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, which now is present in this water. So, Christ is baptized in the Jordan for our health and salvation.